Hello Libra, welcome to a bonus love reading. We're going to be looking at how your person is thinking or feeling about you, what are their intentions or possible next actions towards you. As always, these readings are general, so take what resonates for you, what applies to you, and feel free to leave the rest. All right, so let's jump right in for Libra. Regarding the person they are thinking about or connecting with at this time, Spirit. What do we need to know about this person's thoughts, feelings, energies towards Libra, towards this connection? What do we need to know? What do we need to know about this person's thoughts, feelings, energies towards Libra? Page of Wands, Two of Swords. Nine of Pentacles. Okay, a little back and forth. I'm sensing here with the Page of Wands and Two of Swords. Um, initiative, Page of Wands is all about being excited, curious, willing to go on an adventure. Um, you take the init initiative, the first couple of steps to get there. Um, you just want to go. You're just ready to go. Keep moving. Figure out what's next, what else is out there. Sometimes the Page of Wands could be um, a conversation or someone approaching you. Um, being interested in you, but then I have here the two of swords. So this is all about indecision blocked energy um, This could be that you are not interested or or resistant to whatever this page of wands could represent I'm going to clarify all of these um, in a little bit um, But then the nine of Pentacles. This is independence freedom security abundance This is someone that's living their best life is admired by others successful so this could be um your person how they view you libra this could be how you are approaching this whole situation i feel like this person is admiring you from across the room and it's like i want to talk to libra but what is this right there's like a block here i want to talk to libra i i know i like libra but but this two of swords. So let's see what else we can get. Can we get some more clarity, please, on the energies for this person? Closed off and past life. So I feel like this could be someone that you had a past connection with, could even be a past life connection. But I sense that you're not talking or not communicating at this time with closed off or someone's very guarded. Someone's very resistant, like I was saying with this two of swords. What else? What else do we need to know? What else do we need to know about this person's thoughts? Feelings, energies. Oops. Oh, no. How did I drop those? Bear with me. <laughs> okay. What are they thinking, feeling about Libra at this time? About Libra. I really screwed up. What else? I don't want to lose you. Well, Libra, hasn't this been a running theme? I'm feeling overwhelmed at the bottom of the deck. I feel like this has been an ongoing thing. So let's clarify some of these. Let's get some clarity here. Tell me about this page of wands. Oh, the eight of swords wanted to come out. Tell me about this page of wands. What's this page of wands about? Three of wands. See, I sense like a back and forth, the tug, you know, push and pull here. I'm very interested in Libra. I can see her or him and I love what I see but it's like someone's hesitating or waiting
Maybe this is someone that has already approached you, but they're just waiting for your response. What else do we need to know about this page of wands? What else do we need to know? Yeah, the magician. They're, they're, they have um, drive. They have ambition. I feel like this is someone that wants to get something done. Um, they want to manifest, make this happen. But, but, you know, I keep getting that like, so why the three of wands? Why not just be a magician energy and just go after Libra? What's what's the holdup? And it's someone I feel that has a lot of hope. Yeah, the star, Aquarius energy, or, you know, and there's the five of wands. They could be wanting to heal something. Nine of swords. Ooh, th this person's worried. They're worried. And I, I sense this because it's not up to them completely. It's not like they can just show up and everything is going to be great. Especially if they really screwed up and they don't want to lose you, you know. Maybe they are waiting for the right time to act, the right time to come forward. Why is this Two of Swords here? Let's move on to this Two of Swords. I feel like this is the biggest issue here. Why is the Two of Swords here? Why is the Two of Swords here? Five of Wands. Okay, I wanted this one wanted to come out. <laughs> and the Nine of Swords. Okay, so the issue is them. The issue is them or the issue is what happened. The conflict that exists. Tell me more. about this two of swords tell me more about this two of swords what do we need to know about this two of swords four of pentacles yeah ten of swords i think someone is holding back because of whatever has already taken place i think that they're scared they're going to make the situation worse when I do come forward, when I talk to Libra, when I make my intentions known, when I come, well, whatever this page of wands represents, which I feel is just them making their goal happen. I feel like they, they're hesitating a bit because they don't want to lose. And so they, it has to be perfect. I wonder if you even know about this Libra. I wonder if you even know that this person is having this like internal battle within themselves. Tell me about the nine of pentacles. Why is the nine of pentacles here? Why is the nine of pentacles here? The devil? Capricorn energy. Why is the nine of pentacles here? Why is the nine of pentacles here? Interesting. Judgment. Interesting. Four of cups at the bottom of the deck. The message that I was getting when I saw the devil and I put him down was they cannot and or do not want to be free of you um, they're holding on as tight as they can at least emotionally energetically you know just it's not like they're locking you somewhere in a closet I mean at least I hope <laughs> but it's it's this is this energy of someone that and and it makes sense judgment is here it's almost like i, I want to revive this i need to revive this because i cannot see you on your own without me that's not how I, this should be that's not how i envision this that's not what i want can't get one more for this nine of pentacles Okay, the five of pentacles did want to come out 
Yeah, they they it's it's almost like they 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 cannot be this fight. It again, struggling, feeling overwhelmed, feeling outside in the cold, feeling they've lost something, need help, feeling lost or um, like they're suffering without you. This person is not doing well. This is someone that's not doing well. Now, that's not to say that, you know, just because they feel this way, they deserve a second chance. That'll be up to you, Libra. I'm just telling you the energy that happens to come out here. And there's the Eight of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck, the Ace of Swords. Yes, let's work things out. Death, Scorpio energy. Let's work things out. Let's, it does not, I really feel like your person is scared that this is the end. Maybe this person will tell you, I'm working on myself. I've changed. I've transformed since what's happened. Um, I will prove it to you. Let's look at this person's intentions. Spirit, tell me about this person's intentions. Next possible actions towards Libra. What are their intentions? What are their intentions? What are their intentions? Towards Libra, what are their intentions? The Emperor, Aries Energy, the Tower, the Knight of Wands. Oh, yeah, they're going to want to come right in quickly. Eight of Wands. This is somebody that wants to just come right in. They might surprise you completely. The Tower, the Knight of Wands. The Emperor is almost like this person is very resolved, very um, sure of what they want, very decisive about what they want. Um I don't know if you even want them back or if you want to work on things. I don't think it really matters because this person is going to try every possible way of winning you back or stabilizing things. Um, yeah, Eight of Wands, Ace of Wands, Queen of Swords. Yeah, I think this person, yeah, Two of Cups. I think this person is just very motivated by their need and their fear. So they they desire to be with you. They're scared to death of losing you, and that's enough for them. You know. Would you be interested in this person wanting to come back and reconnect? I feel like you had a difficult ending with this person. I even feel like some of you Libras you have not officially ended things you've just dropped hints or you've had conversations um where you already let them know what you, you know i'm done or, or i'm not interested anymore um but you haven't actually like done it yet so this person feels like this is their last chance or this is their ha the hail mary you know i need to do this and that um and i feel like it's going to be a big display uh with the tower and the knight of wands the knight of wands is very um forceful passionate over the top dramatic with a lot of flair charismatic putting pulling out all the stops with the eight of wands here and the knight of wands it's going to be quickly it's going to be something unexpected and fast and i think it's going to be difficult in the sense that um this person i don't know i don't feel you're here it's like either they don't know how you would take this or they don't care how you would take this um, because they don't have access to you. It's like you're, I, I, I'm visualizing a closet with the lights off. So it's almost like you are, you have disconnected, right? So this person is more thinking about, I just need to do what I know best or what I feel is the right thing to do. And that's what I'm going to do. And I think you're on the other end, like, what the hell's going on? <laughs> so... That's what I have for you, Libra. I hope you enjoyed this quick bonus reading. Uh, leave me a comment if this resonated for you. Like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you haven't already.